If you shoot the head, you kill the ghoul. Shoot the head, kill the ghoul. Hello, this is Palico Page, and welcome back to another episode of Surviving Project Zomboid, or at the very least, trying to. I don't want to talk about it. We've died. We've died from burns to shins. We've died from. Well, in all fairness, the last death was pretty legit. You know, we did get torn apart whilst trying to get bandages which you know is well that's the irony of of getting bitten very early in the game and, and trying to sort of peek yourself up after it we i thought we're doing okay and everything was going fine until i decided to try and preserve my life and when i tried to preserve my life that was it game over game over but hey ho and this time around i'm playing on a different map of the community mod which i've downloaded it's simply labeled as chapel Chap or chapel and it says nothing as far as the description is concerned. All it says, or all it shows, is a picture of a mall sign. And I instantly thought, Dawn of the Dead, Dawn of the Dead. So I thought we'd give it a whirl, and that's as much as I know. As far as the other settings are concerned, I haven't touched them. Zombies are still on 1.5, so in between normal and high. And uh, all the rest is exactly the same as how it's been. So it should still be pretty manic. Uh, we are playing with a bloke this time around, I do believe. And we are going to be playing with... That's not a bloke. Uh, we are going to be playing with... That's not a bloke. With Kenneth Harris. He's rocking the brown t-shirt. Brown t-shirt, I suppose you could say. It, he, he's like John McClane. You know, he's been wearing that... I say t-shirt, it's, it's a vest, isn't it? He's been wearing that vest for a fair few hours... You're bound to get grubby, you know, running around Nakatomi Plaza trying to save yourself from zombies. So, you know, we can understand him wearing a brown vest. It was originally white, we'll say. Uh, green trousers. Well, he's, he's obviously wet himself through fear. Through fear of the zombie outbreak and trying to survive. He's lost his wife. We still don't have a spouse in this game, which is all good. What is he, though? Well, we've said John McClane. He might as well be a police officer, I suppose. He does have to have... A negative trait what do we want to give him conspicuous more likely to be spotted by zombies not good claustrophobic agoraphobic disorganized hearty appetite needs to eat more regularly i suppose we could do that sleepy head smoker how does that work stress and unhappiness decrease after smoking tobacco okay unlucky what could go wrong for you often does you know what? That sounds that sounds good. If anything, that's John McClane for you. He's a lucky. He's the he's the wrong guy in the wrong place at the wrong time. I think that's how it's said. Or is he the right guy in the wrong place at the wrong time? Or even the right time? I don't know. Let's not dwell on it too much. So yes, this is the first official community map cell I've played. So not quite sure what to expect to be honest with you this could well i presume it's a good map or else they wouldn't put it into the big community big map where they're all sort of linked together and uh well as i said malls i'm i'm just i'm thinking dawn of the dead it's probably not going to play out like dawn of the dead probably closer to Shaun of the dead we're just going to be surviving you know throwing records at people debating on whether dogs can look up let's have a look Oh, that's not a good start. That's not a good start. Thankfully, we didn't get bit. My life. So, uh, yeah, we've got nothing on us, Kenneth. Uh, some cool railway tracks here, though. I presume this is the station. We've been accosted at the station. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Anything in here for me? rubbish lots of rubbish lots and lots of rubbish get back you and dead dead guy up yeah if you guys could just clear that out so i'm going to lose it'd be greatly appreciated anything else in here <laughs> thanks i think uh we'll take the sheets uh, you got nothing i think the boxes no I would really like to find some painkillers early on. So I think that would help us. Did I just drop that? I dropped that, didn't I? Oh, the orange is going to be all bruised now. That's not good. Nothing in there. Oh. 
Uh, we close that. You know what? It's open. And climb through really quickly. Run, Kenneth! Run! That was that's not a good start. That's not a good start. Are we are we bleeding? We're scratched. Oh, that's a fence. We've been defeated by a fence. So we just need somewhere a little bit quieter. Are we no, we're not good. We're not good. I've got no weapons, so I just want somewhere I can hold up for a second. That'll do. And we can don't want a bit of clothing. And we can sort ourselves out. Oh lordy, I didn't mean to do that. Go to you. I meant it said rip clothing. In my defence, I, I I didn't think it meant clothing. I've, well, actually, I did think it meant clothing. I thought it meant my clothing. So There we go. At least we're not bleeding. Have an orange, Kenneth. That always cheers me up to have an orange. Are we bad? We're going to be bad, aren't we? This, is, this isn't going well at all. Wood glue? Rubbish. Crowbar. That's what I'm talking about, son. It looks a little bit like Wolverine. Looks a little bit like Wolverine. Can we actually crowbar this open? I'll hold it down. No? That's a shame. Can I crowbar the window open? I can smash it. No. Hey ho. So we're definitely in a town. It's a quiet town. Oh lordy. Yeah, my bad. My bad. One I can take on. One I am not fussed about at all. Get him down. Get him down. I wonder if this is my unlucky trait kicking in. Maybe it was unlucky that I started with zombies around me. You could argue that, I suppose. There we go. You got anything on you? No. McCoy logging. Shut that door. Shut that door. Shut that goddamn door. Please shut that door. Simon says shut that door. There we go. Right. Golf club. Rubbish. Golf club. Nothing on you. Another crowbar. Flashlight. Yeah. Saw. Wire. Box of nails. Could come in useful. Could come in useful. Uh, leads to... Well, lots of blood, supposedly. Now, being a community map, I am very aware that some stairs don't work. This one seems to be okay. Oh, and a hammer. Nice. Do I want to take the tote bag? You've got to carry it in your hand, don't you? Which could be annoying. Anything else? Cereal. That's good. Peanut butter. I'm not one for peanut butter. I'd, You know... I, I will happily eat nuts when it comes to having a beer. All for nuts. Dry roasted peanuts, tip top. But peanut butter, it just doesn't seem right. The only thing I've ever really got on with, as far as having like a peanut butter spread is concerned, was the... Oh, pistol. Do I want it? Why not? Is the... Um, what's it called? Please have painkillers. Foundation. I mean, you never know. You never know. Uh, it was um, stickers, as in the, the chocolate bar. Can we get out on there? They did a spread, which was like chocolate spread and peanut butter. That worked out all right. That wasn't too bad. Oh, oh, oh. I'll take you. Shotgun. Only two, though. It's got a couple in it. You know what? I'm, I'm quite happy with that. We've done all right there. We've done all right there. Someone just died. Or someone is dying. Uh, oh, we've got a shop here. You open? You must be open. You're a shop, damn it. Uh, carrots, rolling pin, no. Popcorn, no, no, no. Oh, we've got a school bag. Let's take that. Pop that on our back. 
Nice. So the hammer can go into there. The pistol and the nails and the bullets and probably the sheet as well. We don't need that. I just want to keep the, the, the quick stuff here. Are you in yet? No. Nope. That's in here. Can of oats. Very healthy. A CD just shoved in with the potatoes. Okay. Saucepan, yeast. Value tech radio. I could take the radio, I suppose. I don't think there's going to be much need for it, really. Pen. Cigarettes. Instant popcorn. You know what? I'm going to sneak out this way. There we go. That's rather cheeky of you, sir. Or miss, should I say? Okay, well. Oh, that's what we need. A hospital at all. Please be open. Your hospital, you're bound to be open. You're like the church, you're open 24 7. Are you okay, friend? You're just kind of just standing there. Not really doing a lot. They're coming for you. Great! That's the sort of distraction we need. Right, so, medicine. Medicine is what we need. Anything for anything? No. You must have something in. Tomato seeds? Really? Tomato seeds in a hospital. Or at least, a, it, it's at least a doctor's. Or is it? Maybe it's a jail. Could be a jail. No. I don't know anymore. I don't know. Yeah. I'd like to think. There we go. Boom. We'll take it all. Why not? Why not? Definitely the painkillers. I'm taking all the stuff I think I'm going to need. I'm used to extract broken glass and bullets from the body. Vitamins could be handy. Used to sterilise wounds and aid recovery from infection. That's fine, but I, I still don't know how to use you properly. More painkillers, more beta blockers, more bandages. Right, let's stand here. Let's not stand here. Good. This is this is good. Right. So. So so so, dirty bandage. Let's take you off. So if I get a alcohol wipe now, can I? See how do I use it? It's not giving me do I have to apply it and then can I disinfect is that are we good if I put one of those on now I'd like to think that's worked I'm guessing we'll see in a second we're going to keep the bandages out the antidepressants can go away we're still Hmm. Yeah, let's put those away. We know we've got them. Uh, beta blockers, not too fussed about. Deadly rag we can drop. Vitamins. Let's just take a shitload of vitamins. And painkillers. We are definitely going to take some of those. I believe painkillers take a little bit of time to kick in. Somebody did say that in one of my comments. Oh, they're gone. Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, I'm going to keep those out. Uh, vitamins will keep out. Alcohol wipes. Good. I'm feeling pretty good about myself. We, we've done all right there. We've done all right. Oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where's my weapon? There's my weapon. Come on then. I realise I now have to fight my way out of here. Which I'm fine with. I'm absolutely fine with. Can we sneak? 
Is it worth trying to sneak out? No, 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 no. Just push her over. Push her over and run. Push her over and run. Get it, get into the, get into the room. Get into the room. What? What happened there? I just like snap my, my head off. These episodes are getting shorter. I'm sure of it. I'm sure of it. Jeez. That was brutal. I do like this map, though. I think we'll be definitely trying this map out again. I think because I chose the unlucky perk, that's why we spawned with zombies all around us. And let's face it, it was all downhill from there. If I pick a more neutral trait next time, or a more neutral profession next time, where I don't have to take any negative traits, I think we'd be on for a good one on this on this map. I am, I am enjoying it. I think the... The levels are right as well, as far as the zombies are concerned. So, uh, yeah, we'll definitely be doing this on the next, on the next one. So, thank you for watching. As always, a like is appreciated, but not always necessarily deserved. And <laughs> I'll catch you on the next one. Take it easy.